friends, it's me, Miss Rachel. Today on Storytime, we're going to be reading a book at the request of one of my good friends, Solomon. This is one of his favorite stories, and one of mine too. And it's called Count the Monkeys by Mac Barnett and Kevin Cornell. Are you guys gonna help me count all those monkeys? <gasps> hey kids, time to count the monkeys. It's fun, it's easy. All you have to do is turn the page and count the monkeys. <gasps> Yikes, one king cobra has scared off all the monkeys. There's one. Turn the page very slowly, very carefully, so he doesn't notice us. <laughs> Look, two mongooses have chased away that cobra. Or is that two mongoose? I'm pretty sure it's two mongooses. Let's vote. Raise your hand if you think it's mongooses. Now raise your hand if you think it's mongoose. Interesting. One, two. Turn the page. I bet the monkeys will come back. Uh-oh, three crocodiles frightened those mongooses. One, two, three. I dislike crocodiles, especially these crocodiles. Move your hand in a zigzag while you turn the page. It will confuse them. Do it with me. Whew. I never thought I would miss those crocodiles, but these four grizzly bears are even worse. One, two, three, four. We're never going to count the monkeys. Okay, put your arms above your head. Make a loud roar. Bang together some pots and pans if you have them. Roar. But most importantly, turn that page. Oh no, oh no, five bee swarms drove off those bears. One, two, three, four. Bees can smell fear. You are not afraid, are you? I got it. Hum a happy tune and smile while you turn the page. All right, help me. <laughs> so happy. <laughs> Phew. Six sweet old beekeepers have shooed off all those bees. One, two, Three, four, five, six. Say thank you six times, very politely. These ladies care about manners. Thank you, thank you, thank you, I thank you, thank you, and thank you. Now finally, the monkeys can come back. Turn the page and count the monkeys. Seven wolves sent those old ladies packing. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Wolves and grandmas never get along. This is very important. Don't look those wolves in the eyes. In fact, you know what? Cover your eyes while you turn the page. Okay. <sighs> oh, good. Eight lumberjacks took care of those wolves. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. <sighs> Thanks, guys. Now it's safe for the monkeys. Give each lumberjack a high five and then turn the page so we can count the 
Monkeys! High five. 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 And high five. Still eight lumberjacks. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And they seem to be settling in. Don't they understand that we're trying to count the monkeys? Tell these guys to scram. Say scram. Scram. Say it even louder. Scram. Good, let's turn the page. Great, nine lumberjacks. They invited a friend. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. How are we going to get rid of them? Any ideas? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Was that your idea? Because it wasn't mine. Okay, okay. We are finally ready to. Oh no. It looks like we're out of pages. This is terrible. We made it to the end and there are zero monkeys in this book. No one ever gets to count the monkeys. I read this whole book and there's no monkeys in the entire book. There's no monkeys there. And there's no monkeys here. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. There's no monkeys anywhere. Goodbye, my friends. Maybe we can count the monkeys next time.